The Citizens Coalition for Change has demanded that Zimbabwe Electoral Commission implements reforms including availing the electronic voters' roll. This is despite a High Court ruling in March blocking release of the electronic copy of the voters' roll, saying it was a sensitive document and could not be dished out carelessly. In an interview with New Zimbabwe, opposition spokesperson Fadzai Mahere aid ZEC to ensure a free and fair election that is in compliance with the country's constitution. We have pushed very hard for reforms including mounting political pressure for the release of the electronic voters roll, the independence of ZEC, the security of the vote and the voter, media freedom as well as respect for political freedoms. We continue to press for those reforms which are mandated by the constitution. Now that we are here, we demand that ZEC and all institutions demonstrate readiness by implementing electoral reforms, especially the release of the voters for ensuring the electoral environment complied with the constitutional standard of a free, fair and credible election. Triple C recently flagged several anomalies in the voters for during the inspection exercise which they allege is a ploy for rigging by the ruling ZANU-PF. Zek Chairperson Priscilla Chigumba, however, is on record saying whether the voters roll has anomalies, whether candidates scrutinize the voters roll and see anomalies in it, whatever the anomalies are, whatever the legal records they will have will not stop the election once a date of election has been proclaimed. The constitution further stipulates that after an election has been called, no change to the electoral law or to any other law relating to elections is effect for the purpose of that election. President Emerson Munangagwa proclaimed August 23 as the general election state. Constitutional lawyer Laf Momaduku told this publication that the election date proclamation is frozen. The current electoral act as such, the electoral act amendment bill currently under debate in parliament will not apply to this election but in future elections. Maduku added that political parties must be more concerned about other Zimbabwe Electoral Commission shortfalls such as the lack of an electronic voters' role.